Hey Frugivores, welcome to this beautiful day. Today's video is going to be what I eat in a day, low carbs, low calorie. Wow, sounds amazing, right? Sounds really satisfying and sounds like the diet that's going to turn you into a crazy person, right? I've done these in the past, of course. It's just a waste of time, but unfortunately not all individuals have education on optimal human nutrition. So that's where we come in, right? So we're gonna check that out on TikTok and um, yeah, leave a comment down below how you feel and let's get into the video. I'm gonna to continue to get this little workout. So here we are on TikTok and um, this individual, what I eat as a gym girl on a cut. A gym girl on a cut, all right. 1600 calories, high protein. This is what you don't wanna do. This is setting up your metabolism for just a failure. Okay, you're just going to damage it. You're just going to um, cause a lot of issues that you have to spend then spend time reversing. Okay, not good. Let's go. What I ate yesterday, consuming 1,600 calories. I started my day with an oatmeal cappuccino. Of course, although you did. I did instantly regret my decision and wish I had a nice one because of, uh, so of course you you started your day with drugs. I, I'm not surprised. Are you? Everyone's got these fancy machines. I, I I've just seen so many coffee machines now. Like the marketing for the coffee machines is out of control. Um, but yeah, okay, she's starting the day with Dragos because she has a deficient diet and that's not good. Decision and wish I had a nice one because it was so hot, but it was still so good. For breakfast, I had two fried eggs on a bagel thin, cream... Who? Two fried eggs on a bagel... What? what? Fried eggs on a bagel thin, cream of rice, protein powder and some... Okay, cream of rice and protein powder. Yeah. Okay, you know how I feel about the henstruations? That's just not human food. That's lizard food. Cream of rice, I mean... It could be higher in carb, I don't really know. And bagel usually has more carbohydrates. So she got 48 grams of carbs. Yeah, that's not much. That is not much for breakfast. She should be having more like 200 grams for breakfast. 11 grams of fat, too much fat. Some straws for health. Um, after this, I went to the beach and tried these prawn crackers. Oh, yikes, what's going on there? What is going on there? It's two prawn crackers. Straight from China, I guess. The flavour was a bit of a rogue choice for me, but they were still so good. I'd give them a 7 out of 10. No, oh, that's that's really not a good snack. You know, that's an opportunity. She could have had a banana. <laughs> At least one, right? Um, so now she's got, like, cream cheese and smoked salmon, probably. Lunch was smoked salmon, light Philadelphia on... Okay, so... Sandwich thins. I sprinkled on some chives. All right, yeah. So she's got a lot of fat going on in this diet, and, yeah, more protein obviously and um we know we know about the salmon and the uh heavy metal risk and the like parasite risk and it's just you know too much fat for your body as well it's a it's an animal and you're not meant to eat animals to make it look like i have my life together it was delish okay let's sort biscoff i refuse to give it up even on a cut these were just biscoff rice cakes and they went down a tree okay so she's having rice cakes at least she's getting some more carbohydrate in there but what is she having on it just a pure fat spread Biscoff? I don't know, that looks really just, I don't know, like a processed nut butter thing. Okay, hey, let's talk Biscoff. I refuse to give it up, even less cakes, and they went down a tree. For my dinner, I had prawns, tomato sauce. Hang on, where's the, where's the fruit or anything, right? There wasn't much fruit, if any. Um, Alright, so she's having a little sea life. Parmesan and some broccoli. Please don't come at me for this one, it was so quick and easy. Um, yeah, they're so unsatisfying. This is so unsatisfying. I would eat something like that and it would just... There's a fly getting around here now, so it's probably going to hear it. But I would eat something like that and my stomach would just be like, huh? What? Well, it's like empty, right? I want to feel full. I want to feel satisfied in my belly. Like, in that stomach area on the left there under your breast, like, I want to feel full there. So then I don't think about other stuff. It's so, so much easier to eat healthy. And to feel great and have great digestion. This will not cut it. Does anyone know the name of this tree here? Let me know. This beautiful little seedling here. Well, it's getting bigger. Can't wait till it gives fruit. <laughs> let me know. Um, and for those who didn't know, I want to let you know that I'm doing one-on-one -on -one coaching, consulting for a limited amount of time, but only for those of you who are over 200 pounds, okay? I really want to help you. I feel like you need the most help implementing the diet and lifestyle and I can show you exactly how to do it and put you on track and yeah I have a lot a great track track record in this regard and um, yeah a lot of experience so check it out I'll put a link here 
you can check it out and you can apply and we'll see if we are a good fit. And the other option to consulting is my books. You can get all my books, the whole lot of them, a lot of information there to change your life for a very reasonable discounted price. So check them out, I'll put a link and yeah, you can definitely do this by yourself, but it takes a lot more effort and focus. These are my babies. And then after this, to finish off, I have protein yogurt. Icelandic, Icelandic style yogurt, more marketing, okay. Um, so yeah, yogurt. I have protein yogurt, blueberries, dark chocolate, and some melon on the side because melon's the best. Anyway, thanks. At least she had some melon, that's good. Like, really great to see some melon, but at the end of the day, oh no, sister. Have it at the start of the day if you're going to. And this protein whatever mistake here, totally unnecessary. It's just too much protein, too much fat. It's not, it's not a good diet, it's a boring diet. For me, this is boring, boring, blah. Definitely. She did have some strawberry there, thankfully. Um, let's watch another one of hers, okay, because these ones have had quite a lot of views, right? This one is like 147,000 likes, so that's a lot of young women pressing the like button and seeing this video and trying to get it to like fit into this. Yeah, so let's watch this one. What are you in a tone up? What are you in a day to lose weight, high protein, low calories to tone up? Okay. I woke up starving, so breakfast came before coffee yesterday. <laughs> There's a, the first sign of a deficient diet. I woke up starving. So even before the drugs came in this abomination, like junk food thing. Today, the protein notes of the day was cookies and cream with Oreos, like crushed Oreos on top. It was so good. This is just, just eating junk food. It's just promoted as something healthy and it's just pure junk food. I've had so many requests for the recipe for my oats and I promise I'll get it posted as soon as Look, possible. Look, I'm sorry, you just can't eat this way. <laughs> I know you really, really want to be, you can't eat this way and actually be your healthiest and your fittest and stay disease free long term. After this, I headed to the gym. I had an iced coffee made with... Iced coffee. 70 ml of Oatly's Barista Oat Milk was okay. really good. Lunch was an omelette with cheese, veggies, and some rocket on the side. Yeah, a lot of protein, a lot of fat again, and not like, you know, it's just, where's the carbs? Where's it's the also carbs? very yummy. For a snack, I had some Greek yogurt with zero. It's sad to have to count 184 calories, 31, you know what I mean? Like when you eat, when you follow this lifestyle, a fruit-based diet, you don't have to worry about like micromanaging your calories in case you go over your calorie limit. That's just, it's boring, right? That just does your head in. That's the diet world. Leave it behind and get on this lifestyle and change your life. You don't have to worry about that crap anymore. You can eat freely, pun intended. You can eat freely and fill your stomach every single time. And guess what? You're not going to get fat. You're not going to get sick. You're only going to get healthier and healthier as time goes on. Zero calorie white chocolate flavor drops from my protein. So Zero calorie white chocolate flavor drops, right strawberries and then some zero calorie strawberry syrup on top oh no she's so scared of the sugar that's so sad don't be scared of the sugar it's it you're much better have off having that than that uh syrup stuff you're having after this i just had a few little random sweets i bet they're just full of artificial sweetener because why not because you know why because you're fruit deficient you're a frugivore animal frugivorous animal yeah, you like it. you're a primate. You're a primate. So, you know, you want fruit. That's as natural. And so that's why you're getting why pushed. Not? You're getting why pushed towards the candy. Sweets. Yeah, so hopefully you in the audience can identify that she is carb depleted, glucose, fructose depleted. She because has a deficient why not? diet. Okay, this dinner is my absolute oh, favourite. Kind of like nachos, but made with crispy potato wedges instead of tortilla chips. Okay. You know those dinners you just don't want to end? That was yeah, that's a lot of fat in there. Very cheesy. You don't want it to end because the cheese is, um, it has a drug effect. The casomorphins, it has a drug-like effect, okay? So you're just going to be um, getting addicted to it. This one, it was so, so good. To finish off my day, off my dinner, I had two crumpets with butter. Two crumpets with butter. Okay, she got some more carbs in there, but very processed. The anchor light version though 
Oh, in my... okay, sorry, yeah. <laughs> the light version. And butter and more I mean, fat. You literally can't beat crumpets and butter. I went to bed feeling super satisfied. She's very focused on what she's eating. You can tell when she's eating that she's like, oh, you know, like she's getting a bit of a carb hit there because the brain is just so depleted because she's been eating like a dummy. <laughs> Seriously, she's been eating, you know, not like a frugivore, but eating like someone who's on some, you know, manufactured industrial diet. Fried and full. Um, and yeah, that's the end of what I ate yesterday. Thanks for watching. Bye. She's so switched on. She said, like, whoa, the eyes are open. She was really hungry. Really, really hungry. So this is like, yeah, what I eat in a day. Low carb, like low calorie. Boring. Sad. No one wants I to eat like stuff. this. Really, no one wants to eat like this. This ugh, is going to digest like a bomb. And they, then they don't know why their guts feel terrible, why they're getting bloated, why they're binging. This, this diet, the uh, fruit-based diet, will cure your binging. It will cure your bloating. It will cure, you, cure your binging and heal your gut. It's the best. All right. Don't forget to go through it yourself and I will talk to you soon.